actions against Taiwan will be responded to in a serious way by the United States. Yes, well, amen to that. The White House this morning is warning China not to escalate things further. America stands with Taiwan. Your basic average Chinese person and family are unhappy. Having a bogeyman like the United States that isn't threatening the Chinese Communist Party in any, it isn't threatening the Chinese people in any material way. If the American forces are taking measures to strengthen the Chinese security and national Weeks of research for this video led me to one conclusion. China is definitely ready. All the proof you need is in this video. When international tensions are elevated, when there's a lack of trust and dialogue, and an uncertain future, attention turns to the profound shift in the global balance of military power. Despite fielding no modern jets or bombers in 1990, China now is inching up on the US in the number of fighter jets. The People's Liberation Army, the PLA, has now grown into the world's largest fighting force with more than 2 million active personnel. With a series of joint naval and air exercises in the waters and airspace off Taiwan, there's an increasing question, how powerful is China's fighting force? that can and will be used to resolutely defend national sovereignty and territorial integrity, projecting strength at home and abroad. Beijing has not fought a war since 1979, and its air force has not participated in a major conflict since 1958. While Russia and Ukraine dominate headlines in 2022 and Germany's involvement in World War II, the United States itself has been aggressive on many occasions. These are just a few countries that have had conflicts, military actions, and wars with the United States since World War II. In 1982, Lebanon. 1983, Grenada. 1989, Panama. 1991, Gulf War. 1993, Somalia, 1994, Haiti, 1995, Bosnia, the US-led NATO force intervention in Yugoslavia in 1999, War on Terror 2001, Afghanistan, Iraq 2003, weapons of mass destruction, 2012-2019, War on ISIL, 2017, present conflict, Syria. May 10th, 2022, U.S. government passes a $40 billion Ukraine package to fight Russia. China has undertaken an extraordinary modernization of its armed forces over the past decade. Navy since 2014 with an overall force of roughly 355 vessels, including more than 145 large warships as of 2021.
This year, in June, China made a big statement about its naval ambitions with the recent launch of its third and most advanced aircraft carrier. The Fujian, a Type 003 aircraft carrier, is the most advanced warship ever built in China and the first of a kind designed by Chinese engineers. The Fujian's electromagnetic aircraft launch system is a significant advance for China's Navy, allowing aircraft to be deployed more quickly and enabling the vessel to carry heavier planes. Between 2020 and 2040, the total number of Chinese naval ships will increase by nearly 40%. The 039 submarine are the most silent diesel electric powered boats with capabilities that could prove tough for the US military planners to deal with. Beijing has built 17 of the Type 39A B subs with plans to increase the total to 25 in the next three years. The subs are equipped with an independent propulsion AIP which makes them almost silent and do not need to surface as frequently to get the air required for diesel combustion, which can then power their batteries. In 2019, the DF-41 Intercontinental Ballistic Missile, which experts say could hit any corner of the globe was unveiled during the National Day Military Parade. But it was the DF-17 hypersonic missile that caught most people's attention. Air-to-air -air missiles have been increasingly representing the future of aerial combat and China has no rivals. A new version of China's most advanced air-to-air -air missile, the PL-15, poses a significant challenge to the American air power. An uber-sophisticated long-range beyond visual range BVR currently is in use by the People's Liberation Army Air Force. The missile will be able to strike manned and unmanned aircraft and cruise missiles from a range of more than 145 kilometers, which travels at four times the speed of sound. The PLXX reportedly has a 500 kilometer range, by far the longest in the world, with no equivalents elsewhere. Meanwhile, the People's Liberation Army has grown to roughly 975,000, dwarfing the US, which has about 486,000 active soldiers.
nation's aviation force totals over 2,800 aircraft, including stealth fighters and strategic bombers. China began fielding its first operational hypersonic weapon system, the DF-17, in 2020. And its nuclear arsenal is projected to grow to at least 1,000 warheads by 2030, according to some estimates. China is still a long way short of the U.S. stockpile of 5,550 warheads, but its nuclear buildup is being seen as one of the biggest threats to Western military supremacy. to have fully modernized armed forces by 2035 and a fully fledged top tier military by 2050. The stakes are quite high and China forges ahead. If you've liked what you've seen in today's video, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching. Reportify Media.